Greninja EX is a new card that just dropped, and it's actually pretty similar to Hisuian Samurai V Star. Its first attack, Stealthy Shuriken, does 40 damage to one of your, uh, your opponent's Pokemon, which is something extremely similar to Hisuian Samurai V Star's ability, which puts 40 damage counters on a Pokemon. And then its second move, Torrential Slash, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, reads If your opponent's active Pokemon already has any damage counters on it, this attack does 120 more damage, which is identical to Hisuian Samurai V Star's move, which does 110 more damage if they already have damage counters on it. I hate to say this because I love Samurai, it's literally my favorite Pokemon, or at least favorite line of Pokemon, but this card is literally just the same thing, but better. It has 30 more HP, its base attack does 10 more damage, and 20 more damage when doubled. And being water type is just huge because there's so many cards that support water type Pokemon. I will say I think Hisuian Samurai V Star does have the edge in the fact that it's a stage one Pokemon and its ability can be used the same turn as your attack, although it can only be used once, which is also kind of a downside. But what do you guys think? Do you think Greninja EX is better than Hisuian Samurai V Star? Do you think they're pretty equal because they both have downs and they both have ups? But moving on from all that stuff, we're going to be using Greninja EX with the new Starmie card because it obviously it's going to work well together this works well with samurai it's going to work well with greninja since they're essentially the same card and then greninja also has the luxury of being able to be powered up by origin form palkia v star but before we get on with the matches if this is the type of content that you like please consider liking this video and if you're brand new to the channel subscribe because i make tcg content all the time every single day it's completely free and you won't regret it but with all that being said enjoy the rest of the video my channel focuses on making or using i don't really make a lot of decks i kind of just find them but using fun decks i would like to go second uh and going to casual and just messing around but this this game has the casual scene just filled with meta decks dude this is the third time they've given me only badoof in the beginning it's actually nuts okay they mulligan also the third time my team my my opponent is mulliganed I don't, I don't know what's going on today but uh Man, like, I'm just trying to have fun with a brand new card with a deck that I don't even know if it's very good because this card just came out. So uh, the first iteration of the decks that come out aren't going to be as the best that they can be because they just came out. Um, and I'm just getting like screwed over by going up against uh, decks that are um like <laughs> top five in the world only. But Arcanine isn't meta, so maybe we can take this out, especially since we have type advantage. Maybe I do think. Arcanine likes having dark damage counters on it, so I it's it should be pretty easy to take out Arcanine with the Greninja. He already has an energy on him. Um, we got a Froki. We got an Irida, which we're going to use. And we're going to take a Greninja. No. Oh, did we just... Wait. Our Palki is prized once again. Ooh, give me that. Hold on. Don't take that. Give me... Give me you. Yeah. And then give me you and you. And then attach the water energy to you. Uh, we don't have a rare candy though. Uh oh. Well, maybe I should have retreated Badoof. I don't really know. What do you do again? Oh. Nothing. <laughs> well, we need a top deck of rare candy. Or, he's for sure going to stoke this turn, which is going to, uh, so he can't attack this turn, but it'll allow us to switch in and out and just take him out if we need to. Uh, yeah. Didn't get anything playable in his hand, which is crazy. Unlucky for him. But this also just means that Arcanine is already ready to go nuts. So if he has a boss, he can easily just boss my... Well, that's not a good top deck. Oh, man, we got an Iono? Oh, wait, hold on. We need to Iono. This is terrible. Two Greninjas and two Ultra Balls at the bottom of the deck? Man, Iono is kind of an annoying card to have. Sometimes. Because, like, you need to Iono. Oh, look at that, actually. Man, I don't want to... Well, this is so terrible. I don't want to put down Manafi. This this guy doesn't... It, it, he's not going to do anything to my bench. Are you serious? Man, what is our terrible luck? Honestly, I, I kind of like Judge more than Iono. Because it doesn't give us as much cards. As many cards. We get two less. Well, except for when we have less prize cards. Like, 
Judge is consistent and doesn't put my cards at the bottom if I still need those cards. You know, like, I don't know. Oh, let's... Please don't... No, there's... I'm, I'm not even gonna try and kid myself. It's gonna run the chart. Is Bro gonna attack with the liver? He definitely has dark type Charizard. Well... Oh my god, these top decks are horrendous. This is actually crazy. I can't even retreat you. What do I do? Boss, the Charmander, slap a water energy on the barrel. I don't know. I can't. Re <laughs> oh my god. One, two, three, four. Oh, I don't want to do this, but I have to. Because I just want more cards. Man, Froki. Do I want another Froki on the field? Well, sure. To start setting up. Well, I believe a barrel can live here. Because I don't want him to die. Each player shuffles their hand and puts it on the bottom of their deck. If either player put any cards at the bottom of their deck. In this way, each player draws a card for each of their remaining prize cards. Yeah, it doesn't mean shuffle your deck, so I can Iono again, and it doesn't mean I'm going to get Greninja. XP share. Why... Is he retreating? Rare candy. Hmm. And Magma Basin. He could have played his Magma Basin before then, but... I guess he doesn't have any energies in the discard pile yet. Doesn't he just retreat in an attack? That seems like it would be, what he would do, right? No, he's not going to. Alright. Oh, I would love to not have to use Iono. I would love to get something more useful. I don't I don't know. Irida would be great. That's not terrible. But I again I can't. I could... Okay, we're gonna do this. Oh, was this a bad idea? What does he send out? Depending on what he sends out... What is, what is this? How much damage does that do? There's the Growlithe. Manafi? I don't care about Manafi. Oh, I don't know, man. <laughs> but Barrel is just important. Give me some good stuff here. I mean, that's not terrible. Nest Ball I can't use, though. Oh, I don't know, man. Just, just... Give me some more useful cards. Frogadier. Frogaman. You may switch this Pokemon from your bench Pokemon. Yeah, that's kind of huge. If we need to. Let's get him ready. And then... Oh, we're feeling great, actually. Hold on. This isn't terrible. This isn't bad. This is not bad. Don't like the barrel being low on health. Man, if he just gets knocked out here, but that's fine. We kind of wasted a boss and an escape rope. Which could win us the game later. I don't know. I'm just playing it as I see it right now. I'm not really thinking about the future. I'm not scared of Arcanine at all, to be honest. Okay, if he has a rare candy. Wait, just please grab Arcanine. Because here's the thing. Just grab Arcanine. Do it. Do it. Don't grab Charizard. If you grab Charizard, I actually hate you. Okay. This Arcanine is going out this turn. This is good. This is very good. Put him on. Put it on the field. Get him ready. Why do they... these people play so slow? Just put Arcanine down. What? Why would you put another energy on him? Wait, what? Sorry for hitting the mic. I don't know if that made a loud noise, but that doesn't make any sense.
Okay, let's just grab you. Let's grab... Uh... Hmm. I guess we'll just grab you. Man, I don't know what to do. I might be thinking too hard about this. I could take out the Charmander this turn. Can Arcanine take me out? I don't think so. I think I could get away with this, actually. I think I could get away with this. I, I just don't want that on the field at all. Uh, hold on, let me do this first. I don't know. I, I wanted to grab that, but to be honest, I just don't want... Oh, wait, actually, hold on. We can grab both. I can't evolve him this turn, so he's still going to be in my hand, but it'd be the same, so I might as well just get him. And then the barrel can draw some more cards. Into another barrel. And then we just take out Charmander here. Even if he evolves into Arcanine, I don't think he can take us out. But I just don't want that to turn into Charizard. So. Sure, Artisan. That doesn't help us. We have a full bench. But he's probably going to evolve and do 250 straight up on us. Which we're going to have 50 health left after that. But that's fine. Because he's going to have a terrible next few turns. Because he has nothing on the field. I don't know why he just didn't evolve the Growlithe. He didn't play this Growlithe this turn. Nice ball. Probably grab another Charmander. Because these players are obsessed with Charizard. Obsessed, I tell you. Okay, well, let's think. Hmm. Is he going to evolve him? Energy search. We can start getting another Froakie ready too. I just realized. We need to get as many Greninjas ready. ASAP. Because that just helps us out a lot. This turn. We can get a lot done. What is he doing? That Arcanine's not going to live long enough to really need those energies, you know? Like, I understand Arcanine needing more, needing more energies because you're going to discard some, but this Arcanine is not going to live next turn. He's not making it. Maybe he thinks he's going to make it. I don't know. Maybe he doesn't realize. We're going to do this. Put it on you. Then we're going to use you. Move one of them to this guy. And press done. Uh, do I play Artisan? I don't think so. So we're doing 480. Plus the Charmander's weaker already. Yeah. This is a little bit unfortunate because we, we don't have... We have the rare candies. So I guess we can pretty easily Greninja. Once we get the, once we get Greninja. But... Rare, another rare candy and a boss. If I were him, I'd put down... Okay. You, if you, yeah, you need to have Charizard this turn. If you want this to be successful. Which if he pulls off, I'll be a little bit annoyed. To be honest, because... Entei, interesting. Okay, he ends his turn. I guess he just can't do much. Give me Greninja. Dude, no way you, I... No, there's no way. There's just no way. That's crazy to me. I guess this helps him, but... Uh... Brokey? Another one? I can't even but do because I have all these... Dumb rare candies. Alright, we'll take another KO. Oh, all the Greninjas are at the bottom of my- The last two Greninjas are at the bottom of my deck. I need a- Thank you, Iruda. You've helped me. You've saved me. Yeah, there's no way for him to- Alright, Wingle. I'm about to go nuts on, the, on this Wingle. <laughs> what is this Wingle doing? One da 10 damage? One damage counter? 
He's about to go nuts. One retreat cost is kind of crazy. <laughs> this guy does have the Dark Terra Charizard, right? I would assume. He wouldn't just be trying to set up so many Charmanders to use the regular Charmander. Or Charizard. There's just no way. Okay. He's going to try and get another Arcanine ready. I'm so not threatened by this Wingle, I could just boss the Growlithe to just get him out of here, to be honest. To be completely honest with you, also this Greninja just has less health, so maybe I just want to get him out of here, you know? Oh, crap. Level Ball. I mean, I'll do this first. I'll fail it. I don't want that. <laughs> Give me Greninja. Give me this. Stop Greninja right there. I mean, do I just take him out? I suppose. Might as well. Sure. I don't know about this game, you know? Like, I, dude, Palkia needs to stop getting priced. Also, I, I don't know how I got all my rare candies here, but um, this game, I don't know if, I'm, if, I, if I really showed off Greninja to his highest potential, because this guy is just not good at the game. Simple as that. BGR, I'm sorry. But uh, I'm a little bit confused. Oh, you can't see me emote. <laughs> this is so sad. All right, what does he got here? Another Charmander? Another Growlithe. He probably just installed the game today. Anyone that uses the uh, Arcanine deck, usually. Let's see what he grabs. He could Great Ball. Rare, he could grab a Great Ball. It might just be regular Charizard, now that I'm looking at it. He's only at two Charmanders. This doesn't scream. Oh, I mean, never mind. I don't really know. Oh, he's about to go nuts. Oh, crap. Free switch. <laughs> well, I do win this turn, I believe. Indubitably. I don't know why he would. I don't know. You know what? I'm not going to question it. Ultra Ball. It is ri okay. It is Char Charizard EX. Why would you? I mean, if you only have two Charmanders and they're both gone, can't really do much with them. So he's gonna evolve him this turn, but he can't attack me this turn. Funnily enough, I can't actually take him out this turn either. Unfortunately, it's just not possible. I'm gonna be doing 240. Oh wait. Never mind. Why did I do less there? Oh, he has the ability. I forgot. Switch. Switch is a good card. I, I, all my good cards get prized. I just, like, in the past three matches, the other two we're not going to talk about because I just fought meta decks. But in this one, still, all my good prize cards were gone. If I was fighting someone actually competent using the Arcanine deck, there was a chance that I could have still lost that, even though I kind of hard counter it. Just because Palkia, Switch, Irida, all in the prize water uh oh, this, I mean, this could be anything i don't know could quabble could just be chen pao but with the ex going that they got i don't know but if it's another meta, meta deck i'm gonna i'm gonna riot i'm gonna lose my mind i don't know why people are so like eager to use meta decks in casual i don't know why i i don't understand why can't casual be fu full of fun fun and games no way you mulligan me okay you mulligan both of us i guess okay okay i mulligan once you mulligan once what once are you
What is this guy doing? Well, he's playing the bog guy thingy, so I want to play Bidoof immediately. He mulliganed again. He's playing the same deck. Oh crap. <laughs> oh no. What's. Oh. Okay, I'll take an extra card. Uh, and I'll. Uh, sure. There's Palkia. Well. Erm. Um, what the scallop? He has be. Okay. Man, why can't I just get the good battle VIP pass luck? Of course, he has to also have it. Lappers. Oh, I see the. I, no way. No way you hit double mulligan and then get battle VIP pass. Two of them. There's no way. What it. Dude, this game wants. This game wants me to lose. Holy crap. I've gotten the worst luck in every single game. Even the ones that I've won. I, I still got extremely unlucky. Holy crap. Manafi's actually going to come in handy. This game. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Well, I'm an artisan because he already has his bench filled out, so it helps me more. But of course, only I only have one. Stop doing. Stop making the noise. I, I will actually like go go crazy if you keep doing that. We should get another uh, Manafi down, actually. Maybe we should get another Froki. Man, of course the game doesn't give me an energy. <laughs> I'm like, are you serious? Are you actually freaking kidding me? Alright, you're these two. Give me... Our... Our Palkia is... Be no, no, that's fine. Our Palkia V-Star can be prized. That's fine. Don't give us a single energy on our first turn. And uh, prize our... V-Star that gives us energies. That's fine. That's really fair. He's going to hit double battle VIP pass on his first turn. But we don't get access to Palkia EX or get any... I don't know. What does that do? I already have all my cards. Now. I don't know what that's going to do, but sure, bud. Sure, bucko. Let's place you down. Place you down. Use the level ball to grab me another... No. Another one of you. Oh, wait, actually, hold up. Sure, I guess. That actually, it really does nothing for me. I didn't realize. But now I realized. There's an energy. There's a rare candy. Uh, can you even do anything this turn? No. Love to see it. Because we only got one energy. Is there a chance? He only... Okay. Hold on. I like Lapras a lot more. I don't know why the per I got this deck from someone else and they just didn't put Lapras in. Lapras seems a lot smarter, to be honest. But, uh... I can't. I can't but do this. He gets the V-Star. He just one-shots my Greninja, for sure. I see no reason and... Yeah, I can't. What if I... Well, there's no reason to do that this turn. If he gets the V-Star, like, I, it's actually wraps for me, so I can't, I can't risk that. He probably is about to get it, because he just put an energy on this guy. Oh, I regret. I regret. I regret now. I want to switch. Give me a switch. We do not top deck the switch. What the scallop. <laughs> Give me the switch. Oh, my God. You're. I don't even get an energy. Are you serious? Give me a switch and an energy. <laughs> are you are you serious? You're joking, right? You're joking. Oh my god. This has to be like some cruel joke. There's no way. Is there even a reason to ultra ball into another No, there's really nothing no reason to do that. Oh my god. This is crazy to me. This is actually nuts to me. He 
doesn't have his... I guess he's, he's getting his priorities straight. He's setting up lappers before anything else. Uh, of course, you get Irida and I... Dude, I, I'm getting terrible luck. I'm getting the worst draws. My my V-Star is be, uh, v, uh, prized for the second time when I needed him the most. And there's his V-Star and his rare candy, which he can use this turn. So Greninja's on the field, and he's going to use his V-Star and then get energies on his Greninja already, which I just can't draw an energy for the life of me for some reason. Oh my god. Okay, here's what we need. We need to draw an energy this turn. Oh, we need to draw way too much this turn. It's impossible. With what I need to do, because here's the thing, I need to take out this Greninja ASAP. I need to take out this Palki ASAP. He's probably doing more damage than anything else. 20? So, 20 times... Uh, 100... Two, no. He's doing 260 damage. Which is not... That is more, but... I don't know. I feel like I'm getting screwed over a lot here. This Froki is down. I mean, realistically, I, I want to stop playing cards. There's no way they don't give me an energy, right? There's just no way. Okay, thank you. What do I want here? Another star you? Yeah. Wait. <laughs> no, I didn't. Oh, yes, I do. This is fine. There's no way I'm doing enough damage to take this out in one shot, though. Hold on. Well, this is actually screwed up. Dude, Greninja's not strong. <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it. This guy is not doing much. Okay, let's just... Uh, we're definitely going to do this. I don't know why I did that to be honest, but we'll get Palkia ready to get become deceased. Alright. Well, we'll take you out. So you can't use your hail. Because that's gonna put me in big trouble. There's our Okay. There's our Palkia. So now we have just as mad, just, okay, wait, we're actually in a pretty good position here, I think, now. We have finally recovered because we got lucky with the card that we drew right there. So, what can we do here? Um, he's not going to one-shot Greninja. <coughs> Greninja. <laughs> so we get another Greninja on the field. He puts down Hal Halucha, uh, which, who does he put damage on? Two damage. Okay. completely fine okay i don't unless you're planning on bossing but barrel you don't even need to do that's good okay, doing that to barrel completely worthless misplay i see it on palkia though 100 okay this still doesn't one shot me right especially since you just have you, that would have done the same amount of damage oh no 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 okay i see i see the vision but this still should not one shot me 260 Plus 20, so 280. I should still have 20 HP left, which is enough to do some damage, get some stuff done. We have another Greninja. He has another Greninja cooking. Uh, we can... Uh, I kind of want another Star Me. He, has a, he hasn't used his V-Star power yet for some reason. He should use it before, because before Palkia just can't use it no more. No mo. There's a frogadier. So wants to get another Greninja ready. Um. 
the mirror matchup is crazy. But we have two different iterations, so it is interesting. It is based off what's in the discard pile. Oh my god, I didn't think about that. Uh, our star power is doing... Uh, wait, it's going to do literally nothing. I don't... I made a mistake. Did I? Can I play this gold one to, sh to flex? Give me a star me. Wow, you are so useless so often. It's actually crazy to me. So we could take, we, we have a couple options. We could take out Manafi. We could take out Badoof. We can get rid of his draw support. We can take out the thing that allows him to protect his bench. We could take out Froakie to get rid of a, uh, another Greninja in the future. Dude, Greninja just doesn't do that much damage, to be completely honest with you. We don't need to take out Manafi. I think Manafi is fine. Alucha is fine. You can actually... Uh, you're, you're, you're a threat. We take you out. We, we slice you up. Carve this Froki up. We take another prize. He's going to take two prizes this turn. So he's going to be ahead of the prize trade, but... I don't know. I don't know. We can Iono his hand, I guess. Because we don't have a great hand anyways. Once we play this energy... Do we have an energy in here? No, I want to get maximum value out of... Palkia seems like the strongest thing here, to be honest. Because we, we, our benches are always full. There's his Palkia. Here's the thing. If we can get Starmie, like I want, we can knock out Palkia this turn. So that we're, uh, we're going to be way ahead in the prize trade. Because he's not going to knock out our a Greninja with his own Greninja. It's just not going to happen. He's going to be a, a head on damage on it. But oh, we're not going to be ahead of the price trade no matter what. Oh, we're in a bad position. There's another Greninja. Or Froakie. <coughs> My bad. Man, once you get behind... It's, I, it's so hard to make a comeback with how the game is now. Like, these cards are ridiculous. All right, he takes two prizes. That's huge, I think. I don't think you help me here. I think you help me though. Get another one of those buggers down. All right. Let's grab this. The switch is big. You're big. Wait, we have no more Greninjas. The last Greninjas are prized. So you're doing 240, which means... Wait. What do I do first? This? I guess. Water energy. Two forty, which will take you out. Yes. What's a Greninja? Yes, that's huge. Iruda and Greninja, that is actually huge. Hold on. We might be in a really good position here, because... Because, yes. Because, yes. He can't take me out this turn. Uh, I also can't even... Okay. Oh, you're annoying. <laughs> you're just annoying. You are just annoying. Oh, I don't know, man. He's going to get a Greninja. Another one. Does he have more Greninjas than me? He might just have more Greninjas. But he has no way to get energies on this guy. And we have our Palkia still, which just does more damage. Now he's doing double damage. I honestly don't think that would have mattered. 
this wouldn't matter. He's still going to take me out in two turns. So he kind of just... I mean, he's right. He might as well do it, but... Yeah. Kind of pointless. I mean, sure. Take Trinity on next turn anyway, so. Wait! Oh, wait! Wait, I, I just realized I, I have two and he needs three. I think I just won. There's no way he can... He, can, he has to... He ha I have two Greninjas ready to take out this Greninja. He needs to re retreat and send out something else, but he can't take me out with anything else. I think I just won. I, <laughs> I thought I was in a stickier position than I actually am. Because even he can't even if he moves this damage from Palkia, it doesn't matter, right? Oh, he could get a he could he could get a little something here. He could get a little bit of something. Hmm. What does he grab? I'm curious. Starmie and energy retrieval. Can't play the Starmie. And it, energy retrieval doesn't really matter. He gets two. Two energies, which he's going to attach one to his Greninja, right? We just won. We beat the Ditto. Even though I felt like we were losing it. And we also got extremely unlucky. So, is here's the real questions. Is my version of the deck better? Or, did I play better? Because I, it definitely wasn't that I got more lucky. Because I didn't. <laughs> uh. Okay. What does this do for him? <gasps> oh wait, no, I'm an Affy. <laughs> oh, did he? He thought he was cooking for a second there. I thought he was cooking for a second there. I thought he got me. He forgot about Manafi. Should I just Iono his hand and my hand as well? Oh, wait, let's do this. I mean, I guess we Iono, right? We have no more bosses, do we? I kind of want a pal pad in this deck. But. I don't know. <laughs> now we're not going to deck out now, which is good. I will just do this. Now both of his Greninjas get one tap by both of my Greninjas. Doesn't matter what he does. And this Greninja, he, he didn't even attack my Greninja this turn, so. But he's going to this turn. But it, once again, doesn't matter. It does not matter what he does. His efforts are futile. Because somehow I'm at two and he has that three, even though he was ahead of me. I don't exactly know what happened here. How I got ahead. This also does not matter because he's hitting me for 240, which is 260 total. I still have 40 HP left. I just hope he doesn't concede. I want to see. I just, I just want to, I just want to play it out. I, I want it to play. Okay. So I won, right? Unless I can't do math, I just won. All right, give him some cards. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just do the math. I don't want to mess up math. 
I'm not trying to disrespect the guy. I just really don't want to mess up the math. Genuinely. Because it would just be really embarrassing. So I want to 100% confirm that I am taking him out this turn. Which I am. Okay, I overkilled it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to disrespect. But we have won the Greninja EX Ditto. And there was Frogadier. Um, I don't think my deck was better than his. His deck seemed to be more... He did more, way more damage to me. His deck seemed to be more uh, consistent. Because I was extremely... Un I just... I, I think... I don't think I was really unlucky. I just think this deck is just maybe not as good. Because... Uh, like... I don't... I, I, I don't know. I just feel like it's, there's some inconsistencies. Um, so... Wasn't a better deck. I'm just a better player, baby. That's what it is. I'm better. I don't know. But that's a new Greninja EX uh, card. Do I think it's good? Not really. Maybe there's some cards in the future that can come out that will make it do better. But in, in my complete honest opinion, um, doing 240 damage is just not enough. And there's no card that does enough. Like, I, I can't think of anything that this would really synergize well with. Because what card is going to... It can one shot a couple things, I guess. Uh, a lot of uh, Vs have 220 health or 230 health or in lower, um, which you, if you damage them, you can one shot those things. But the really big guys, you're not one shotting them. You're not two shotting them. No, you are two shotting them. But yeah, there's there's, there's just no one one shot potential. And with Manafi in like every single deck, his first move just kind of useless. If he was putting down damage counters instead, I could see it being a little more useful until Jirachi comes out. But as it stands right now, I don't see it being very good. 300 health. I mean, that's tanky, but there are much tankier things in the game. Um, so, all in all, uh, I don't think he's great. Maybe he can fit in some uh, water type decks, but I just think Chen Pao is just much better. Um, I think Greninja would be great if Power Creep wasn't so terrible and there were things like Dark Terra, Charizard EX, and UV Max, and Chen Pao, and. All those things in the game if those weren't in the game this guy would be really good but when there's so much terrible power creep and they introduce cards that are actually pretty balanced within uh the the power creepness the balanced cards turn out to just be not good because the overpowered cards are in the game so yeah that's my take on it let me know what you guys think down in the comments down below and uh, if you enjoyed this video smash the like button and if you're new subscribe because i make tcg content every single day as stated in the beginning of this video. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.